completed my investigations with the staff. I must say I'm 99% satisfied. Which means you still have a 1% doubt? Yep. One very big percent. Well, you see, whenever there is a property and money involved, we leave no stone unturned. Everyone is a suspect. But the property you're talking about is mortgage at the bank. We know. But what about Bill's insurance policy, which will give you a hundred million dollars? Well, Detective. Detective. Detective Pasha, <clears throat> my father issued insurance policy in our names, and I have totally forgotten about it. Why don't we assume that you thought of it just once? Excuse me, what are you driving at? To so the fact that everyone is a suspect? What's happening? Can someone please tell me what's going on? Calm down, Jackie. Just put yourself together, okay? No, please tell me it's not true. Please. This is Jackie, Bill's secretary. Maybe you'd like to talk to her. Sure. Madam, you are Bill's secretary. No, I'm his wife. What on earth are you talking about? When did Bill make you his wife? Last weekend in Nigeria, we got married in a registry in Lagos. We wanted to give a surprise party to give the news to everyone. But it seems that put us to it. This is getting more interesting. Can you give details of your sudden marriage to Bill? Bill has always believed and trusted in me. And I have never disappointed him. We went to Nigeria to sell some of his properties. The agent introduced us to this client. The bill clicked. The client asked for two days to make the payment. We waited for the weekend and for the first time since I have known him, we made love, had sex, then and then he went on his knees and proposed to me. The next day, Bill surprised me by taking me to a marriage registrar. And there we got married. I never knew my marriage with him would last for a moment. Can we please see the marriage certificate? Sure. I came with one hoping to show it to a friend of mine. Can we keep this for further verification? Sure, you can. Okay. Thanks for your cooperation. You told me you had a perfect plan for a hundred thousand dollars. You told me to become your brother's sex machine. I did. You told me to kill for twenty million dollars. I did. You contracted me to marry you for twenty million dollars. I did. But now I can't even boast of twenty Ghana pesos. How pathetic! Could you please shut up? No, you shut up! You told me nothing was going to go wrong. And nothing will. You think I'm going to stand there and want that bitch be the sole beneficiary? Every dollar belongs to me. Every fucking dime is mine. Impossible! Everything is possible. And what are you going to do? Kill her? She is as good as dead already. And you will be the first suspect. An assassin killed Bill. Jackie was his PA and secretary. If Bill can be killed, then anyone else who's assumed to know about his dealings 
can also be killed. Think about it. It's logical. It's a business risk. everything you need but only this time I want a perfect job I'm not known for unfinished jobs Bill was my first and only mistake Good to get 
I came to visit her. She lives around the area. So what I do now? I work with um, Casa Preco. This is my card. Okay. Yeah. We produce Alomo Beetle. Okay. Mm. And right now we're running a promotion. You could get lucky. With one Ghana city. Ah. Just one Ghana city, your whole life will be changed. With what? You can win a house, not just any house, a beautiful big house. You can win a car, you know, a whole lot of things. So how do I enter this promotion? I'm going to get you a chip. This is the chip. Okay. Hmm. Look at that. You scratch this part uh -huh. and text the number to the short code there. Really? One Ghana city and your whole life will be changed. Okay. Okay. That's good. So, just one Ghana city. One Ghana city. They are always gone and you never never true. Mm -hmm. You talk all about that. <laughs> Yo, uh-huh. You are always a lucky guy. Lucky and jobless, I beg. This guy makes things happen. Yeah, but at least you're in love with me. Yeah, and you're, yeah, and you're in love with me too. Hello. Whatever, we're all in love. Aha, uh -huh, my man. So just one Ghana city. One Ghana city. The difference is made. <clears throat> Baby, can I have this one Ghana city? Like, I knew you were going to ask me this. Are you serious? One Ghana city. No. I beg. No. I beg. No. I beg. No. I beg. Okay, because of your friend, I, I feel sorry for you. I'll give back tomorrow. Yeah, right. Like in a year, you mean? I think, yeah. This is 50. You pay me seriously with interest. You see, you're even holding coins. <laughs> oh, yeah. My man, here. Yeah. Misha. Yeah. You are on, man. Thank you very much. Yeah. Just register yeah. and put all your details yeah. on the shop do Don't forget with your full details. Don't worry. I'll use the details. All right. We'll meet again. Yeah, easy. Have fun, easy. Eh? Take Bye. care. Bye. Take care. Bye. Bye. Let's go. Oh, I guess that's good luck. You're going to win this thing. Trust me, you're going to yeah. win. Yeah. If you yeah, think yeah. so. A house, a car? I'm telling you, I don't believe it. Seriously, it's too good to be true. Man, I don't think that guy is born like that. You are too gullible, I bet. No, Give no, it to no, me. No, no, no. Guys, it's yeah, it's <laughs> but, but ask for a job. That's better. Eh, <laughs> uh, because you gave me one Ghana CD. <laughs>
is if the Pacheco filed a report to her get our insurance money. But there's a problem. Chanel, when she finds out we're together, she could kill. I've already taken care of that. she be taking out? After we received the insurance sanction letter, there's one problem between us and the money. Spectre Jake. So the verification exercise reveals that the marriage certificate is genuine. More so, most signatures are accurate. They are regular. What? Now let's imagine we are seated before a registrar as a marriage corpus. <laughs> Why should I imagine getting married to you? Why not Frank Raja, the movie director? Don't be silly. Be serious. This is no time for a joke. I'm sorry, okay. sir. Let's assume this is our marriage certificate. Why did you use my pen? Because it's normal. Yours was closer. Get two tickets to Nigeria. Let's check this out. It's been given to her, sir. Brandy, sir. Good. Sir, we got a fax from London. We've got the license. Great news. Spread the word to the rest of the staff. Yes, sir. But, sir, you have to leave immediately to London. We have barely a week to seal the deal. Don't worry. That's excellent news. <laughs> Hello? Hi, Brandy. Hello? Hello, Michelle! Michelle, I have good news! Michelle, I have won the Castle Brothers contest! I won a car in a gym place, which I don't know what to do! Oh, God! Great, congratulations! Congratulations! Congratulations is just not enough! Look, I need you here in 30 minutes. We have to celebrate. Um, Brandy, I'm kind of busy right now. This is what you do to the woman you claim to love. I just told you I won a Casapreco contest, and what are you telling me? I swear if you're close, I would have given you a hard hit in the balls. I need to see you here now. You have to put on your best clothes. We have to celebrate. I beg, I'm going to change into something official. Okay, all right. Okay, take a pen and a paper, and then jot down the address. 72 at Bofu Street. Okay. Okay, okay. See you soon. I'll be there. Bye. You know what? Uh, get me a dress. Ah! Ah! Yeah. 
So the company paid for all this? Yes, they did. And the flowers. I really don't know what it is called, but whatever. I don't care. Look at it. And the PlayStation, my good look at this. I can play this all day. Are you okay? I have to go to the village by the weekend. Why? My mother is sick and she needs my presence. Your mother is sick? My mother is dying of a terminal disease and the doctor says she needs $10,000 for surgery. $10,000? What am I going to do? I guess I just have to take a seat and watch my mother die right before my eyes. No, Ronnie, don't say that. Don't. What else do you want me to say? She, she's been there for me all this while. She's put me through school. Just made everything comfortable for me and I can't even raise money to, to, to save her life. I'm a useless child. No. No, you are not useless. Brandy, tell me. How useful am I to my family? Listen, I just think maybe we can raise some money. That will probably be able to cover for her dialysis. I've waited all my life. She needs me and I have to be there for her. No, I'll go with you. No, no. I'll go with you. No, stay. I'll be fine. Okay. I love you. I love you too. Not too tidy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, too tidy. <laughs> okay, do you want to finish this? Yeah, I'm, I'm all right, I'm all right. Are you sure? Yeah. That house. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Bill was here with Jackie, his secretary, who felt slightly dizzy and had to leave for the hotel to get some rest. Leaving you and a crime to turn on the deal? Yeah. Okay, thanks. One more thing. We would like to visit Surilere Local Government Marriage Registrar. The office must have been closed by now. The office opens by 8 a.m. and closes by 4 p.m. You will have to do that tomorrow morning. Well, madam, thank you very much for your cooperation. You're welcome. This is the next one. Is everything ready? Yes, sir. So we have to leave now, else you miss your flight. Okay, okay, all right. Your phone, sir. Oh. Okay. Hello? Michelle, I need to see you before you leave for the village. Um. <laughs> I'm leaving now. It can't be possible. You know the road to my village is very long and very terrible, so it is not possible to see you now. You must see me before you leave for the village. I have something for you. What is it? I'm not telling you. Surprises are sacred. Come and see it, okay? Please do come. Okay, all right. Bye. Call the general manager for bridge service. Tell him to delay the flight for 45 minutes. I have to see Brandy. Yes, sir. What is this? That's ten thousand dollars. What? For your mother's skill. I took a loan from the bank. I used the house, the cars, and all the other properties as a collateral. But don't worry about it. Definitely, we'll find a way to repay. Why did you do it? Life is precious, my dear. Your mother's life is paramount, so 
Go and save. I'll just be here and pray for you. And we'll find a way of forgiving you. How can I ever repay you? I'm going to cherish this for the rest of my life. I'm happy I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Put it in your pocket, please. Right. <laughs> Pockets, please. a few questions. Please go ahead. Show you the snaps. Do you recall seeing that face here? Yes. She wedded here some few days ago. With him? This man? No. The man actually refused us taking his snapshots. But we got one of his snapshots with one of our secret cameras. Can we see it, please? I say, dear my love, my love, come on, how are you, honey? Boy, you know I miss you so much. I wish you were here with me, baby. You left only your picture, but can't imagine what's on in the future, eh? Hey. No call, no letter, baby. Do you know how I miss you, my baby? If it's worse or better, baby, I'm dying. So this is my letter from me to you So please reply Boy, I'm not getting well, oh How I wish I have wings Like I will fly away I will fly away So if I had wings to fly I'll fly away I'll go far away to look for her if I'm to make a wish, I wish you'd be here with me tonight. If I had wings to fly Brandy, what's it? I've been duped. Duped. By who? Michelle. 
Janelle, I've lost everything. I sold all my properties. How foolish I might have fallen in love. Andy, so you can laugh to the extent of selling all your property. What is wrong with you? You know what, girl? You're such a disappointment. You see, this game is the specialty of intelligent criminals. They never give up. I was in Nigeria over the weekend. I met with the estate management. We were in the middle of a transaction. Our dear secretary pretended she was ill. Left for the registrar instead of the hotel. Then Mr. David was already there waiting for her at the registrar. Then they got married. I wondered why Bill has his signature on the marriage certificate. They are remembered. Our dear Bill trusted his secretary. He signed on those documents without looking or checking on them. That day, 105 people traveled to Nigeria. I have spoken to 104. Mr. David happens to be Mr. Teddy. What do you want? Why do you want your brother Teddy? Is it because of the insurance money? Not just the money. Mm -hmm. I hate him. My dad loved him more. That made me a second class citizen in the house. When my dad died, I realized he had transferred his business and property in his name. Anytime I wanted something, I had to implore to Bill. And that made me sick. Tell me what you want, and let's close this case. What makes you think I would like to accept bribe? Don't underrate my intelligence. If you didn't want money, I'll be behind bars right now. How much? 25% of the whole amount. No baggage. Done. Give the insurance company a clean sheet. I want the sanction letter as fast as possible. Smart, Rule number one, never underestimate the bitch. What if I complicate the issues like this? must be Brandy. Yes, I am. How may I help you? Well, I'm Rooney. Rooney Lawson. Please 
forgive me. Please. You know why? Because I walked in here being in anger and hatred for you. Wishing for nothing but to make sure you spend the rest of your life in jail. But right now, I'm standing right in front of you wishing for nothing but intimacy. I love your guts. I love your zeal and drive. I will make you my friend. But first of all, you have to tell me the reasons for your act. Alright, come up. Like, you mean, like, sex? Well, uh, he's never really asked for it. And if he does, would you allow him to? <laughs> yeah, what is it meant for? Wendy, I thought you said you were in love with Michael. Well, I, I still do love Michelle, but it's just that, what, I haven't heard from him for, like, three weeks. And seriously, they say that a bird in hand is more precious than a promised cock. So, till then... I don't know. I can't believe you. Well, you know I miss you so much. I wish you were here with me, baby. You left only your picture, but can't you imagine what's on in the future. Eh? No call, no letter, baby. Do you know how I miss you, my story? If it was the best, baby, I'm dying. So this is my letter from me to you. So please be blind, boy, I'm not getting well, oh. How I wish I have wings, like I will fly away. I will fly away, yeah, yeah. So if I had wings to fly, I'll fly away. I'll go far away. Far away to look for Far away And if I'm to make a wish I wish you were I wish you would be here for me I wish you were How are you? I'm okay. My friend, Chanel, Chanel, Ronnie Lawson. The famous Ronnie Lawson. My pleasure to meet you. 
The pleasure is mine. Brandy, I want to take you to the garage so you make a choice of a car. And as well, get you a driver in some aid. I have taken a one more break at the office and I would like to go with you on a world tour. Me on a world tour? Yes. There's no problem at all. Everything is under control. I have the sanction letter with me here right now. I'm just gonna dress up and meet you at the point. Yes, I'll be there. I'll be there in a jiffy. Just hold on. All right then. Bye. Montana Life Insurance Company Limited. Insurance sanction letter. Whole life. Double indemnity bond. Beneficiary, Jackie Bill Elbit. Policyholder, Mr. Bill Elbit. Accidental death benefit, $100,000. Policy number, KA1981157552. Policy status, enforced premium pain. How did Teddy get this from Jackie without telling me? I have. Yes, we have your share of the money. Well, donate my money to the orphanage. What? You heard me. What is he up to? What? 
He wants his money to be given to the orphanage. The orphanage? Why? You're asking the wrong guy. This is the first time I have seen fear in your eyes. Never face death so closely. I sent you on this errand. Trust I won't abandon you. Since you called and told me about a sanction letter, I knew Teddy was up to something. So I followed up. They've already withdrawn the money from the bank. I know. Everything is under control. This game has to stop. It's getting too bloody. The bloodier, the more fun it is. I'm actually hospitalized for a while, but I'm okay now, as you can see. Oh, you're not happy to see me? I think those smiles I've always known you for. I've missed you. How are you? Fine. Can't you believe my age? What is it? You don't love me anymore? This is that so much has happened. So much. <laughs> what are you talking about? You know, for three whole weeks, I felt so abandoned. And I found somebody else. You mean 
You couldn't wait for three weeks for the man you claimed you loved? The car's outside. Who are they for? They're mine. Yours. I never have one Albert Lawson. Oh, so you fell in love with him, right? Huh? Please don't ask me questions. I don't have answers to please. I can't believe you sold the love we shared for one is wealth. How sickening is it to people? Miss Saul, stop it. Don't say that to me. Please, don't you ever say that to me. I am not a seller of love. Don't ever. Patty, you made me fall for you. You were so kind to me. Just as you are kind to the burgers. You saved my mother's life. And you brought smiles to my face. Now all she desires is to set her eyes on you. Her son's only bright. Hello. Hi. I'd like to make a donation. The people No question. Hello, Jake. Your money is at your home. I've come to return all that you've given to me. Why? I'm no longer comfortable with them. And why? Because I can't marry you. Why? I'm in love with someone else. Please forgive me. Could you let your the guards you offered me come and take the stuff? Brandy. Brandy. Congratulations. Mission accomplished. You are the boss and the brain. Kill her. Don't be scared, brother. You've not seen a ghost. But why have you declared yourself a winner when the game is still on? You saw me being shot, right? But you've forgotten that there's a difference between being shot and being killed. You only saw what I wanted you to see. Not yours or my plans were working. You were watching my every movement, but I was keeping a tab on you. I never would have known you wanted me dead, if not for the call you received at the hospital. Toya, what have you done? He is not dead. That was in a coma, but unconsciously, I knew what was happening around me. You planted a maid to watch over me in my home, and planted a secretary to watch over me at the office. But I planted the criminal you wanted to use against me. To 
to watch over you. The one you contracted to kill me had herself killed. You transferred the money to a private account number. And with the password game, I transferred the money to the insurance company. You see, brother, you've lost the game. So what do you want me to do? Go down on my knees and beg you. Kiss your feet. Huh? Well, guess what? I'm not gonna do any of those. You better do what you came here to do, or else I do it for you. Because I have a lot to live for. Do you understand? I never did like you anyway, and I never will. I hated you with a passion, and I still do. Because I hate you so much. <laughs> Don't turn down my proposal. I love you and I still want you to marry me. Do not convince me into making a decision that will haunt me for the rest of my life. My love is not with you. My love is with him. So please, save yourself the embarrassment and go. Please. Ronnie has all that you ever desired in life. He's been your long-lived groom. Don't feel pity for me. Just follow your heart. I have nothing to offer you. I'm grateful for all the things you've done for me and I can't ever stop thanking you for that. But it's you I love. Then marry me. Marry me and make me happy. So put your ring on my finger. I'm Ruli Lawson. And these are my aides.
Take that down, Jake. I'm not afraid of honest people. Fortunately for me, you want as such. Jake. Hmm? My brother wants me dead. Why? You find out about it. Give him a share. Let's go. 